I can't do this for you anymore. But uh, Merry Christmas. Enjoy your family and enjoy Connor. What? what? No, I don't, I don't want him. I don't want Connor. I want you. Then what was that? I don't know. Why are you huddled in a corner with Riley? None of this has anything to do with Riley. This is all happening because of you, Harper. You not telling your parents about us is a choice that you made. It is not that simple. Do you know how painful it's been to watch the person that I love choose to hide me? I am not hiding you. I am hiding me, okay? Our entire life, we have been expected to be these perfect golden children. I mean, love in our house wasn't something we just got for free. It is something that we competed for, and if we veered off their course, we lost it. I, I know it's messed up, okay? I get it. But they're my parents, and I am scared that if I tell them who I really am, I will lose them. And I know if I don't tell them, I will lose you. I don't want to lose you. Come here, come here. No, I don't no, no, want to lose you. Here, look at me. It's okay. Don't. Stop. I don't want to lose you. You're not. Matilda and Magnus. If you want a present, <laughs> you better have a number. What's up? What's up? Anybody else? Uh, Pop. Sorry? Waits. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. You? Yeah. Yeah. Me bench. <sighs> thousand? Th thousand plus? Everybody have your numbers? Kids! Slow, slow, slow. Mm, Can we yeah. just talk for a sec? Oh, what's there to talk about? You and Abby are in a romantic relationship and you've been lying to the family about it for God knows how long? Does that sound about right? Just, or? please don't tell mom and dad yet. Please, so, I'm telling them after the holidays. <laughs> just rip it. Please promise me you won't say anything. Now it's just very bad timing, and I'm telling them everything after the holidays anyways. Honestly, I feel sorry for you. Mom and Dad are going to be so heartbroken when they find out you've been lying to them. So <gasps> if you my kids found you... Are you kidding me? No one's supposed to know yet. We had an agreement. I'm sorry. I guess I'm not the only one with a secret. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, that is, that's, that's good mass. Yeah. That is solid. Yeah. Thanks, man. They all look so nice. Just choose, Jake. Uh, eeny, meeny, my, <laughs> just kidding. Oh, what do I do? What goes on in other people's families? You need to just keep your mouth shut. Shut your mouth shut. Uh, I should run. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Levi. <clears throat> oh, I wonder what this one is. Abby, get the Santa. I mean, stay out of the stuff. I don't know what this is. Big. <laughs> oh. Oh, oh, oh. oh, gosh. Here, help me out here. What, 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 what is this? It's a painting of Main Street. I made it. I love that. Harper, do you want to tell them or should I? Don't! Sloan! Why? It's not good timing. <laughs> Stop that this instant! Come on, guys, just hug it out. Shut, Shut up, Jane. Jane! Don't do this, Sloan. All this because you're scared to not be the favorite. Pathetic! Sloan, you're making a scene! I am? You think she's so innocent? All of this is happening because Harper <laughs> is. Oh! 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 Lesbian. Abby's her girlfriend. <laughs> she is lying. I am not a lesbian. Sloan is the one that has this big.
God damn it, stop it! No! No! I put 100 hours into that painting and you, you just destroyed it like it was nothing. It was something. I am something. And guess what? I like myself. And maybe you all don't because I'm not fancy. But whether you like it or not, I am a part of this family and I will not be left out anymore. No! Stop it, girls. Stop this right now. Kids, what are you doing back there? Playing hide and seek with Abby and Aunt Harper. Abby? Oh. <sighs> Wanna go for a walk? Okay. Okay. Come on. My parents loved Christmas. We would do all the stuff. We would decorate and do the tree and watch like every Christmas movie. After they died, I, I couldn't really bring myself to acknowledge Christmas. Huh. The holidays were just a huge reminder of them not being here. So I really thought maybe this year with Harper meeting her family, it would just feel different. I don't, I don't think that she loves me as much as I thought she did. Hey, Harper not coming out to her parents has nothing to do with you. How could it not? Remind me, what did your parents say when you told them you were gay? Um, that they loved and supported me. That's amazing. My dad kicked me out of the house and didn't talk to me for 13 years after I told him. Everybody's story is different. There's your version and my version and everything in between. But the one thing that all of those stories have in common is that moment right before you say those words when you're heart is racing and you don't know what's coming next. That moment's really terrifying. And then once you say those words, you can't unsay them. A chapter has ended and a new one's begun and you have to be ready for that. You can't do it for anyone else. Just because Harper isn't ready, it doesn't mean she never will be. And it doesn't mean she doesn't love you. I, I want to be with someone who is ready. Mm. 